Welcome to EF Pod English, brought to you by EF Education First and English Town. Learn anytime, anywhere. Pod English Elementary 18. Weather. This is KWA TV. Your eyes in the skies. I'm Joshua Tobeman. Looking forward to your weekend here on the coast. It's going to be a glorious sunny day with cool breeze and very nice temperature, as you can. Can we have some temperatures here? Oh, okay. No, I think I think I think we have some technical difficulties. Yes. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. Why don't you go over to your English lesson and we'll be right back in five minutes. In this lesson, we'll talk about the weather. Look around. What's the weather like? Is it sunny? Is it raining? I'll teach you some more words to talk about the weather. Two friends are talking on the telephone. Jessica lives in Los Angeles, and Adam lives in Shanghai. Hello. Hi, Adam. Hey, how are you doing? Are you getting ready for your visit? It's going to be great. I'm really looking forward to showing you around Shanghai. It's so exciting. Great. Me too. Actually, that's why I'm calling. What do you think the weather is going to be like next week? This afternoon, I'm just going to do some packing. Well, it's going to be cooler than Los Angeles, and it will surely be rainier. In fact, according to the local weather forecast,、uh, it's going to be partly cloudy and rainy this week,、uh, and then even rainier next week. Really? Is it the rainy season there now? Well, it's not really the rainy season yet. But we had some severe weather last month. We had showers every week, and、uh, this month it's going to be even rainier. So I should definitely bring my umbrella. Yes, you might want to bring a jacket too. It's a little bit cooler than Los Angeles. It'll be about 15 degrees when you get here, and it might dip down to around 10 degrees at night. 10 degrees? I thought you lived in Shanghai, not in Siberia. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I mean ten degrees Celsius. Let's see, that's about forty-eight degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, good. That's more like it. That's much cooler than Los Angeles, but not too severe. Anyway, we're gonna have a great time. Let's look at some of those words Adam and Jessica used to talk about the weather. Partly cloudy. This means there are some clouds and some blue sky. Do you know the words we use when there are only clouds and no blue sky? Overcast. The sky is overcast today. Severe weather. For example, very strong winds, or maybe a thunderstorm. Weather forecast. This tells us what the weather will be like tomorrow. We can watch the weather forecast on TV, or listen to it on the radio. Adam and Sally also talked about the temperature. You can measure temperature in Celsius or Fahrenheit. London is cooler than New York. We add er to an adjective to compare two things. Can I have some water? Let's practice the grammar、Thank、in、you. the movie. We're working here. Read the sentences. Shanghai is 10 degrees Celsius. Los Angeles is 25 degrees Celsius. Complete the sentence. Shanghai is cooler than Los Angeles. Repeat that. Shanghai is cooler than Los Angeles. Let's look at another example. Let's now look at part of the movie. Watch the people, then listen to me. Repeat what I say. In fact, according to the local weather forecast,、uh, it's going to be partly cloudy and rainy this week. It's going to be partly cloudy and rainy this week. Repeat that. It's going to be partly cloudy and rainy this week. Well, it's not really the rainy season yet. But we had some severe weather last month. We had some severe weather last month. Repeat that. We had some severe weather last month. Well done. 
You have now practiced talking about the weather. You can say, "It's partly cloudy today." It's overcast. We've also talked about other useful words like weather forecast. Can you remember how we measure how hot or cold it is? Yes, that's right, Celsius or Fahrenheit. You've also learnt how to compare two things. Shanghai is cooler than Los Angeles. Well, that's it for now. I hope you've enjoyed your lesson. We have some clouds coming in, but nothing severe. Nothing serious. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be just, just fine, just fine. Nice day.